Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another video. We are back on the ice, late ice. It's almost the end of February, and we just had some crazy rain the other day. Pretty much wiped out all the snow on the lakes. Got the cleats on just to make sure I can stand in the house. Super slippery, but we are gonna get set up. We're gonna get some pike candy down. We're targeting pike again. We only got a couple weeks left to do it, so we're gonna make the most of it. We're in about eight feet of water. Let's just get right at it, get fishing. All right, we've got the sucker minnow on. Went with a little smaller one this time, hoping that when the pike come in, they'll be able to inhale that whole thing on one little swoop. Therefore, I can get a good hook set. Gonna be using that on that bait feeder again. Hopefully, we can get that to go off and get a pike today. All right, then for my jigging rod, I figured, you know, we'll do a little match the hatch. I'm gonna do a perch colored Castmaster spoon. Let's see if we can get that color there. There we go. You know what? Figured I'd match the hatch today. Love a gold flash down there on a bright sunny day. Last couple of times we've been trying some different bigger baits. Figured I'd switch it back to a spoon. I was thinking about throwing a minnow head on, but I have a little smaller sucker here. So just to double our chances, let's maybe start with a whole sucker minnow. See what he does down there on the spoon. Something different versus the minnow head. All right, here we go. Let's turn the camera a little bit. That looks way too good down there. Let's hope that the pike went to candy today. So let's get underwater. Looks like we got our first fish coming through, a little bluegill. Last time we picked one of those up, it was actually a pretty nice bluegill. It's a good sign, fish are moving. Oh, what's this? Oh, some nice perch. Oh, those are nice perch, guys. I'm gonna drop this little tungsten down. See if we can get one of them. They look like they uh, want to eat. They're going after my sucker minnow. Let's bring one of them topside. This will take just a second. Look at that. Look how quick that comes in. Boom! Inhaled it. <laughs> Not big by any means, but got Mr. Perchy. Let's let him go. You know, let's pick a couple of these up real quick while we're waiting for Mr. Pike to come through. You know, you can see how hungry they are, just charged up. We're out here looking for pike, but you know, these things, look at that, boom. Ooh, this one's nice. Oh yeah, look at them, oh, oh yeah, get up here. Look at that one, that's a, that's a keeper. You were keeping perch today. Look at that one, huh. Uh, look at them all, got a nice school down there. We'll do this for a couple more minutes, then I'll get that spoon back down. You know, the main objective's northern pike. Looks like he's coming back. Now here he comes. Jesus. Birch. Just no guy. They're gone. Let's get the spoon back down there. It's pretty fun. That's why I keep that close by because you just never know what's going to come through on the camera. So let's get back down there with the big minnow. A couple perch to start the day off, never, never a bad thing. Looks like the perch are back. Look at these guys, you think you're gonna eat, eat that? All right, well, it's probably been about a half hour since they showed up last. Put this guy off the side. I'll grab a couple of you while you're waiting. Look at them following me down. These guys are so hungry. Oh. Look at that. Aided on the downfall. Boom. Little guy, but man, are they hungry down there. All right. Look at them all down there. Ooh, that one's kind of nice. I'll grab you. He's even chasing after him. That one right there that's turned around, he looks nice. Oh, he'll, he'll go for it. Come to say hi. There we go. 
little upgrade. Man, there's so many down there. Great eating if you can get into a batch of good ones. that the piker is hungry as he's perch man look at these keep this school here track the uh, predators Oop, another perch oh, here they come all right let's pick which one we want take that bottom one we'll do a little picking and choosing which one looks bigger? Probably him. Just gonna play keep away for a minute and see which one's a little bit bigger and we'll, we'll select them. We'll look at them coming in now from the back. Oh, we got a perch frenzy going on. But we'll take him right there. Perch frenzy. I see Mr. Pike. Okay, I'm gonna reel up. If they're heading out. That could be a good sign right there. That could be a good sign. All right, what time is it? 12:34. We have been out here for two hours. No pike yet. Just some perch cruising through. A lot of hungry perch at that. And what I'm gonna do now is gonna change it up. Cook some food out here. Have a nice little hot meal I brought in a tin foil. Some chicken alfredo, last night's dinner, and I thought, hey, let's bring it out. We'll throw it on the big buddy heater, heat it up, and in about a half hour, we'll have a nice warm meal out on the ice. You know, got nothing else to do out here while I'm waiting for these pike to come through, so here's the big buddy heater. This is what's been heating my shack all winter long, keep me nice and warm. So we're going to place this right on top, just like that. So let's get back to fishing. Here we go. We're back. And we are back to jigging. So let's get back down there. <clears throat> Wasn't even looking. Got a nice little perch here. Yeah. I was catering to my lunch, flipping it over, but hey, we'll take this perch. He looks pretty nice. Yep, look at the size of that one. Got him. There we go. Another perch, another bad one, another great one, but something fun to catch on the camera. I was tending to my meal, not quite ready. And I saw him came up and checked out my spoon. It'd be nice if a pike would actually come through and say hi. Just got more perch and perch and perch. Oh, here we go, guys. Here we go. Look at that. What is that? What is that? What in the heck is that fish? I thought that was going to be our first pike, and I have no clue what that fish was. It was big, too. Looked like it was caught on something, swimming sideways. Maybe a big old ball of weeds on it or something, but that was different. Let's get back down there. Maybe it'll come back through. Looked like he was kind of cruising. I'm not sure. I'll have to rewatch that footage when I get home, but that was interesting. I always say, you never know what you're going to see on the camera. Oh, well, I don't think that's coming back, but good news is, my food is ready. So let me grab that off the uh, grill here. Or I should say the heater. It's been sizzling good. And we have chicken Alfredo. Ooh, nice and hot. All right, let's get that on the plate. Rarely do I ever eat out on the ice, but look at this, guys. Oh, got a five-star meal right here. 
All right, that's how you clean a plate right there. Can't beat a warm meal out on the ice. Let's get back to jigging. Got some strength in me now. Nope. Birch are back. All right, well, it's been a pretty boring day. No pike yet. So I might at least get a few more fish topside. We'll send this back down. Tons and tons of hungry perch. Never ends. You can probably sit out here and get a bucket of these guys. Oop, here we go. Got him. It's a decent one. My day is a complete perch day today. But anytime you're on the ice catching fish, or I should just say ice fishing in general is a good day. Looks like the only thing cruising around hungry today minus a mysterious big old fish. Well, unbelievable. No pike today on the camera. Just tons of perch. Kind of crazy. Sat out here all day. Didn't see any pike. But if you think about it, really, we're only looking at about 10 feet by 2 feet little area on a giant lake. So every day we're out, pretty fortunate to see as many pike as we do. Today they just weren't roaming. They must be hunkered down somewhere. I got to get going. That's a full day for me out here. You know. We saw a mysterious fish. I'm not sure what that was. You know, by now you guys know what it was. I'll have to get back home and can't wait to see what that was. Got about a week left to target Northern Pike in Minnesota. And then we'll be out chasing panfish until the ice season ends. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Take care. And we'll see you back for another video.